Hi, Wayne Schultz here with a uh, demonstration of an issue that uh, involves a wrong phone number for the e-filing. Uh, this is just to uh, point out where that number is located since it may be easier to see in a video here. Uh, if you go into modules and then into payroll, of course under the period end is where the uh, e-filing all happens. Click on the federal uh, e-filing under the setup. This is test data. Uh, it won't allow me to go in without an 06 number. So I'll punch that in, uh, tell it that I want to work on W-2s. I haven't gone through to look and see whether this issue um, happens throughout other areas of the program. So far as I have only looked at, it was in the W-2s. It very well may be populated in other help files uh, that are specific to forms. Uh, I, I wasn't able to tell whether there's one generic help file or whether everyone has their own uh, help system. So if you do uh, set up here, it should populate us, hopefully, with the W-2s in a second. Doing its thing. Set that up. Set that up. Uh, we see dummy data with uh, employees that come with Mass90. Uh, at this point, if you use the F1 key to bring up a help file, and let me just narrow this so it goes to the screen. Um, if you go to the uh, processing W-2s and the processing e-file, if you come down to here, I believe this phone number right here is the number that you're looking for which reports back as out of service, at least when I called. Again, this may populate also to other parts of the form. I'm not exactly positive. I didn't exhaustively search it, but I know that this number, uh, in essence, is the one that's wrong. Hope that's helpful. Wayne Schultz here, uh, Schultz Consulting. Thanks.